Kibo sends his regards from beyond the grave. Please. So, the new mayor has been elected. Who is he? Melvin Silver, everybody! How are you going, Mel? Yeah, no, I'm good to be- I'm happy to be here. It's good, yeah. 
I'm happy. You are happy to be. I am happy. Yeah. Well, um, yeah, we haven't had a proper mayor here mm -hmm. in like five years. Yep. You know, ever since the last one, we, <laughs> we killed. Crazy. I hope that doesn't happen to me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's crazy. Um, yeah. So the town's pretty. It's been pretty out of control. Mm -hmm. So, you know, with all the. All, all the murders happening, like you know, seven Carter Rev massacre. Yes. That's quite it. crazy. Yeah, yeah. yeah I'm, I'm looking forward to getting the the town back in order. Yeah, yeah. And I'm working with the police to to help find the murder of Potty Gold. Um, he's a yeah. former police officer. His name's Bob. If you yeah. see him, make sure you mm. you try and get him, and mm. then we'll, yeah. Because that is two years to this two day. Two years to this day. Since he died. It's crazy. Um, so yeah, um... Man, good to have you on here. It's good to be on here. So yeah. Um, on our next segment, we'll be reviewing the new film that just came out, Ben 10 is in the Woods, directed by, um, Jim and Mira. So yeah, stay tuned for that. Oh, hey, what the fuck? Kev? What the fuck? <laughs> it's me, Cliff. He's got blonde hair, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Yeah. You see that? Yeah, I know. I don't trust that mayor guy. I mean, he seems like he's on the right track to try and get Bob and all that, though. Yeah, well, I don't know. I just don't trust him. They're kind of sketchy, so... Well, true, we have had some pretty sketchy mayors over the years. Exactly, like the last one. We um, haven't had a proper mayor. I don't know how long that guy said. I'm sorry, I can't let you stay here anymore, Bob. I'm sorry. Why not? Do we have some sort of problem here? No, 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 no. Please don't. I have a family. Yeah, so do I. You're not special, okay? <laughs> Yep, we're on. Yeah, all right. Um, yeah, shocking, breaking news as um the new mayor that I interviewed a few days ago, Melvin Silva, is has been found dead. It's crazy. He's been found that he, he got shot eight times by uh, a gun. Um, as you can see over here, follow me. He did have a nice aircon, so that's good to see. Also, um, he had he had children and everything, but he also was looks like he was a big fisherman. So very sad news. We don't know who did it, but we are suspecting that it was someone around this area. You know, it was probably someone that is been previously known to murder people. So yeah, it's pretty crazy. I would recommend not coming here because you know. It's a dead guy in the house, you gotta get it out. If you live next door, just stay there, I guess, because the killer could be in your house. Um, on a more upbeat note, um, uh, just looking back on the first horrors from Bimpo, because um, it doesn't get enough love, I personally think that it is a masterpiece. 10 out of 10 film. The second one is garbage, and I have to see the third one, because I'm also a film critic. So yeah.
looks like the Bimpo hook is a got a discount. Too bad I can't do anything about it. Hey man, this hat smells like fucking smoke. Yeah, sorry. I mean, I I like these, but I can't actually use them. You know what I'm saying? That would suck being a kind of a stoner. That's the one, man. Yeah. And not being able to yeah. eat the right one. Like these aren't even the good brand. They're just being fucking dying. Yeah. Well, I, yeah. It's a bit. I got it. I got you, I got you. I think that's good. Yeah, because I get these, um, I can't use these on, uh, you know what I'm saying, I can't use these here. Yeah, yeah. So I can put it in my mouth, it doesn't do anything, because I have lungs. Well, yeah, I've uh, just been drinking a lot of alcohol because of how bad these brands are, so yeah. <laughs> I guess that's one good thing about them, they taps these to the max, though. Mm. I've just been buying less C's. Are you just, um, glossing over the fact that you just tried to kill yourself? Yeah, man. Um, Let's just take a step back for a second. Yeah, well... That's pretty... Um, I don't know, this might sound dumb to you, but just the way I act is I don't like to bring things up in the past that have hurt me. It just makes things even worse. Then why but I you, could have a little chat. Then why are you seeing a therapist? Well... I don't know. I don't actually know, man. No? Yeah. Don't you got, like, another appointment? Later today. Yeah, I, I do, but the man's kind of slack. Like he's cool and all, but he does what I, he kind of brings up things up from the past rather than trying to help myself. Right? And he think that's that's his way of trying to help people yeah. by like bringing back old things and trying to get to the root of it. But to me, it just makes it worse. So you're just trying to forget. I'm the trying past. to forget it, yeah. but I don't know. I, well, that's I, fair. I never really been to a therapist, so I didn't really know. I mean, hopefully in a few years you forget I existed. I mean, like, of course you got to have memories, but still, like, I don't want you to dwell on the fact that I'm dead or whatever. Yeah. I can't even see the... <laughs> Try this one, because this one, um, I can't do Better anything. brand? Yeah. I got those from some guy in the afterlife. I think his name was, like, Barry or something. <sighs> yeah. Oh, shit. I think Barry used to give me drugs. These ta they tax these motherfuckers so high, and <coughs> there's just barely any filters in here. <laughs> that yeah. is so strong. Yeah, no, there's no filters in the afterlife, which you don't. Yeah. yeah, so um, back to the actual topic of you trying to kill yourself. I see your point is, but why don't you just try and live on and just forget the past, you know? You know what I'm saying? I don't know, but... Except for, of course, Bob. Because, you know, Bob is... Um, Bob is a big problem for you. Yeah, well... That's kind of why I've been seeing a psychiatrist lately. Yeah? Um, honestly... I'm trying to find out my problem. Even though I kind of know the rest of my problem, obviously, but help get better, but, um, he was just telling me, like, the death, the deaths are less affecting me than actually the fact that I just can't find Bob. Yeah. Like, that's the main source of my root. I have nothing, and I have this, this thing that I need to find, but just I can't find, so it's just yeah, like, the root of my fucking problems, um, yeah. Just yeah, can't well, find him. like, this might sound crazy, but maybe I could try and locate him through the astral plane. You know, like through the spirit world or whatever you want to call it. That's just real? You think... Yeah, man. How do you think I'm here talking to you? I don't know if I'm actually real, because I could be just you imagining. But I could, yeah. if I'm not, I could actually try. Sure. You know what I'm saying? Like, um... <laughs> Look at it, yeah. It's so cheap. <laughs> Think of that, man. I gotta go. Yeah, that's um, because of the ladder I gave you. <laughs> that is the cheapest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> it's still going. Like, look at that. Yeah. <laughs> it's all black. <laughs> should I try to take a puff out of this? Oh, uh, I don't know, man. It's got. It smells like plastic. Oh, that'd probably make you sick.
Yeah, I would throw that away, man. Thanks to the new map, like, what did he lower the prices or something? Oh my god, man. That's so crap. Okay, I'll get rid of it for you. Just put that in the sink. Yeah, yeah also, I, I, it, I am still going out of limb if you want me to try and find him, but if you... Yeah, well, I feel like... I mean, I don't know, I'm bringing this up. It's been, yeah. We've been both trying to find them for years, but if we try to find them both, but we look in different areas, I reckon we've got a better chance. Well, I can go anywhere, so yeah. that's the thing. Um, I'm just going to need absolute silence while I'm doing this, if that's alright. Yeah. So. Sure, that was fit. That was really weird. I think, um, I, I couldn't find him for some reason, but it gave me flashes of stuff that I think is going to happen. Strange. That is, yeah. Like, I saw his face, but without the mask on, but I just knew it was him. Mm. If you know what I mean? Yeah. Which, that might be another reason why you haven't been able to find him, because you haven't seen him without the mask on. Which, no one, for some reason, knew there was a mask <laughs> before the incident. Well, I think he was just such a... I don't know, like, we, we were cool with him in a while, but I never looked into it like that. It was yeah, weird. Well, you only knew him for, like, what? For yeah. A few hours? Yeah, like, maybe an hour, actually, not even. Yeah. Only I knew of him, but I never met him till like yeah. just before I found out he was. And I only met him when yeah. we got um, almost got arrested down the corner. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. Um. But yeah, yeah. That's insane. I'm yeah. Gonna... I was looking down. You know, I'm about to. Well, I will, and I have been for years, obviously. Yeah. Looking down around that area, and I know his old house is back down there, so. Well, it wasn't his house, but it was Kevin on Skits' house. But I know he always used to be there. Yeah. But it's just a shame because I always go past it hoping he'd be there. But it's I'd... just out. Like, there's nobody living there. It's just used for, like... Yeah, it's abandoned. Yeah, it's now. kind of abandoned. There's just been this car there, like a little reporter car kind of a thing, been sitting there for very long. Well, they're probably doing the same thing as you. <laughs> yeah. How long has that car been there? Two years. Same amount of time as I've been looking for him. Yeah. Same amount of time as me and Potty died with the police. Yeah. Yeah, man. Um. So. But. I know. What's it like in the astral kind of thing? Oh, it's pretty cool. I think. Like. What's it feel like? Like, is it so quick of a glimpse at the moment that you don't know how to describe it? Um, or do you have a certain... It kind of feels like... Um, 
you're basically dream. You know, like you ever had a lucid dream before, where like you know you're asleep. Yeah, yeah. Like you're actually awake in the dream. Yeah, it's yeah. kind of like that, but like better. Because it's real, I think. I mean, at least I think it's real. Yeah. So. But yeah, it's pretty cool, honestly. You can do whatever you want. Unless that's like killing someone or something. Like that. I mean, technically it doesn't matter because you, you're just imagining someone because you can't kill someone. In yeah. Because that's crazy. That's like yeah. the new problem. Try and figure it out. Yeah, see you later, man. Yeah, see you later. How have you been since the last time I saw you? Well, I'm gonna start this off by saying, my name isn't Kevin. It's Kev. It says it on my birth certificate. So, so your name it, is it's just Kev. Kevin. It's Kev, yeah. Okay, so, so Kev, Kevin how was too long. Been, how have you been lately? Not good. Like, I always come here, that's the reason I'm here, but I've just been terrible. First yeah. off, it, it just started with me. I was at home, and. I saw this homeless guy, right, I left my house later that day, and I beat him up. I beat him up. Do you, do you have a reason for that? I just, I don't know, and I don't know why I'm smiling about such an unfortunate thing, but I beat him up. I, mainly for his just, drugs. Okay. So, is there a reason you've been acting like this? I've been taking too much drugs, and just the fact that I only had really two friends and my parents are dead, I just... What happened to those friends? They got killed. And I've just been trying to find the person who killed one of my friends, Buddy Gold, for a long time now. And I just can't find it. I'm starting to lose motivation and drugs always help. But at the same time, they're just making me worse of a person. Yes. So, so is, yeah. is that everything that's been going on? Pretty much, yeah. Is there anything else that you'd like to add? Not really. Are you sure? Yeah. I think you're hiding something. Are you, are you sure that's everything? Ah, shit. Um. Man, I'm not trying to hide anything because I literally tried to kill myself last week. So that is something else. And we need to work on that. Well, of course. I, I, need, am, I need you to be 100% truthful. Well, I'm going to do something like that because you just heard all the things I've been going through. I don't think I'm just going to not do it. Uh, I just didn't think I needed to tell you, I thought you just kind of... That's not the way to get out of these situations. Yeah, I don't know. But, 
what I did. Um, but I haven't done it since, so getting a bit better on that. But besides that, I've been pretty shit. Mm, I reckon we need to work on that alcohol and drug abuse. And we need to find something else that you can do to Sheeps. keep his company. Um, well, I don't really have anyone or anything to keep me company, except my drugs, but really, there is one thing, but I don't want to discuss it. Are you sure? Yeah, no. Maybe you could make new friends, do, do some other things outside of the house? Well, I'm, I'm not really in a good neighbourhood right now, I kind of got the best of what was there and it's a good little house well big house but it's an unfortunate area and I, I just don't want to make friends with people that would live in a place like that they're all just gonna probably make my addiction worse mm. by giving me more of what i'm trying to get off mm. but yeah I, I don't really know what else to do um yeah that's really yeah. Long. Okay, well, I think your time's up for today. Good. Okay. I'll see you next week. Yeah, I'll be back here, hopefully. Okay. Work on work those things that we've talked about, yeah? Yeah. Jesus! <laughs> no, it's, no, it's just me, Cliff. You remember me, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Although Jesus is a pretty cool guy, he's a real party animal. He's real? Yeah, Jesus is real, <laughs> no. Zeus is real, all the gods are real. Thor, you know Thor? He's real. Whatever. It's crazy, crazy. I mean, like, it might not be real. Everything's real in the afterlife. Yeah. What? Well, yeah. Alright, I mean, will this even work? <laughs> I'll try and use my haunting powers to summon fire or whatever you yeah, want. Yeah, yeah, whatever, bitch. Right, it's just on. Yeah, you got it, man. Is that all I'm good for? <laughs> much. Except for helping me find Bob. You done that yet? What? You, you found Bob yet? Oh, no. Oh, well, he's. Sorry, here's the thing. It's kind of <laughs> hard because, like, I'm kind of leaving this place, you know? Why? Because um, I'm kind of. I mean, I've still got unfinished business. Oh, but, is that where you've been but here? My, yeah, yeah. My, but if I tell you, I'll kind of won't be able to leave, if you know what I'm saying? But my soul is already ascending, pretty much. So I did get glimpses of where, he, where Bob is. Yeah. He's somewhere around the edge of East Bimpo. Like, he's hiding somewhere there. Have you checked there when you've been walking around? Nah, I'll, nah I haven't really checked out yet. Yeah, I mean, he's... But he's soon been... I might check out around this area. Oh, yeah, yeah, he's been... Oh, but pretty, eventually I'll probably check out. It's been pretty elusive yeah. these two years. I can't do anything with this. Well, it's you just... You want me to light it again? Yeah. Yeah, alright, well... It's tough, man. Lucky you didn't kill me, because the way Potty died was... That was terrible. I haven't seen much of him either. I actually haven't seen him at all, really. Just saw his, Probably, I just saw his soul go straight up into the sky. We just didn't have much to do. Yeah, I mean, maybe that's all he had no unfinished business. Simple guy. Yeah, he was crazy yet simple, you know? Yeah. He had no problems with anything, really. Yeah. Well, especially after Kid Boy Skid died. So, if you need me for anything, I'm going to go party with Jesus. Unless you want to celebrate the discovery. I might just go look for him, so... But, I don't know. Depends if you want to. How about, when we celebrate? We call up Ricky or something. Ricky. I don't know if I'm going to celebrate with him, but... Oh, neighbors okay. around here. But, I don't know if I'm going to celebrate with him, but I'm definitely going to call him up, because yeah. I need to restock the drugs. Is he still doing that? I don't know. That's why i got to call him yeah. up. Yeah, well, I'll see, I'll see you later, man. Yeah. Sorry, I can't give you this. It's basically yeah, not this, real. This doesn't light very long. <laughs> yeah, it's crazy.
actually not gonna pick it up. Just give him a text. Stupid border correct. Ah, uh, is he gonna fucking... This dude's a slow type, man. Ah, uh, I don't have the patience for this. Oh, there we go. Not married. This guy is fucking slow. You know what, I'll just wait for him to do that. I'll grab a quick drink. <sighs> oh, my freaking foot. Let's <sighs> give that a guy a call. Doug Jones speaking. State your business, please. Oh, uh, um. Hey, Doug, I was just sent here by a mate, Ricky, Ricky Blitz. Oh, yeah? That's not really relevant. What do you, what do you want? Um, drugs, honestly. Oh, uh, yeah, that I do have. Um, I'm Doug the drug dealer, after all. Yeah, yeah, it's kind of why I called you, but yeah. Yes. Yeah, yeah, uh, uh. Anyway, I'll see you soon, man. Yes, you will. What? what? That was the weirdest job deal ever. Spoken to. What the hell was that? Oh, shut up. Oh, oh, it's you. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, Doctor Flebus. What are you doing? Here? What are you doing here? You know, you, I thought you were. Uh, what? Is this just some scheme you got going? Like, you get patients addicted to drugs, so then you can make more money and they'll keep coming back to you and back to you and back to you. How do you know that? 
because you're at my house for right now. I'm not going to fuck up my floor.
Yeah, um, it just doesn't hit anymore. Really? Like, the strokes? Really? <laughs> yeah, honestly. Yeah, well. Because, I don't know, I don't know, but <sighs> probably just took too much. I think you've been taking too much for quite a while now. So, yeah. yeah. I'll catch you later. Yeah. Yo, uh, uh, it's been a while, man. Yeah, what but, you want, man? Well, you know, Steve, like, uh, Ricky's not really selling anymore, and I know that you owe me from when I gave you the hookup back then, so I was just wondering if uh, we could just meet up and get the usual if you're still dealing. Yeah, well, I guess 8.40 is good because the bottle shop was just about to shut then, so I'll go grab a beer, I'll go grab a beer and then meet you up uh, about, yeah, yeah we'll just meet up Old Spot, Lee Street. Yeah, yeah, yeah. right. That's just Central Vimpo, isn't it? Yeah, it's near your house. Yeah, yeah. Well, I'll meet you up there, man. Um, got to stay on the down low, though, because it's pretty, um, a right, lot of, um, yeah, a lot of feds around there as well, so. Good though, I didn't like dogs, so. Yeah, yeah. man. Um, keep in contact. Still trying to find Bob, by the way. Yeah, yeah. Well, good luck with that. Yeah. I'll see you then. Yep, I'll see you later. Yo, Cliff. Yo, what you got there? Um, well, I've just taken the money out of this. It's a, a royalty check because of how they made that film um, based off like, uh, what happened last year. Um, how much money are you getting now? Well, not a crazy amount, but it's pretty good. I just, the movie's a bit of a letdown. Yeah. I think I got like, well, the royalty check, I think I got about $200. Oh, yeah. But... Sick. Um, I think I'm gonna make more off like advertisement money because they need to show me in trailers. They need to show me yeah. in a lot so of things. Like, and they could they anytime they show the movie. Yeah, know. even though it's not actually me, the fact that it's based off me. Yeah. I know. And because of the fact that you know you're dead, mm. um, I also get a pay increase because they got they don't have to pay as much people. They just give double what they would have gave to me. So I think I might even get another four hundred next week, which is pretty which is pretty good for not having a job and just living off. So, retirement funds and living off what you left behind. Yeah, which um, isn't much. Which isn't much, but it's good enough to buy me a bottle of beer tonight, which is what I'm going to go down to do. Aren't you going to save it? Save it up, well, not, I'm saving that, but the, I haven't even spent any of your inheritance money yet. So I'm going to buy a quick tab from, um, remember Steve from high school? I mean, I think. Remember? I didn't go to your high school. Yeah, but like, uh, you, I've talked, I've talked about it before. Um, is he like the tall guy? He's like quite kind of tall, shorter yeah. than me, but like, yeah. he's tall for his age, I think. Yeah, and yeah, but he used to sell me drugs when he was in year seven and I was in year ten. Yeah. So it was a weird situation, oh, yeah. but his brother knew me. But I think his brother died when he was in my year, which was pretty weird. Some weird thing going on there, but. Oh, Drug abuse, yeah. I guess, didn't get, didn't take the well of him, but yeah. Yeah, um, Ricky's not selling anymore, yeah, so I had yeah. to go to him. Ricky is his thirtieth birthday is on this weekend, yeah, and he's fucking he's getting pretty old, so he can't keep his life going. He said, 
I think he just wants to start a new life. Settle get, down. You know, settle down. Yeah. Get. I think he started a new job and maybe have a wife and eat kids or something like yeah, that. Yeah. Whatever Ricky wants to do. Yeah, but know. he's just getting his life back on track, I guess. Just like what I'm trying to do. Um, Ever since I moved out of his place, when he showed yeah. me that you were renting out this new space here. But what I'm getting tonight isn't going to be super crazy drugs. Like, I know I went a bit crazy the other day, or whatever that was last night or something. Yeah. But, yeah, this one is just going to be like a little tab, but I don't know what will happen, that's the thing. Mm. I just want to try it out because I've been just taking the same stuff for a long while. It's what I used to get. It was my old usual. Yeah, from Steve. Yeah, from Steve. Um, we're just going to drive down Central Pimpo, and I'm going to grab a bottle. Uh, okay. I'll grab you something, but you can't really drink. Um, because you're dead. <laughs> And yeah, so... How's that psychiatrist? How's he doing? Oh, fucked. Um, I had to... Well... I assumed I got rid of his body off the yard. You killed him? I thought I didn't. I thought I just, you know, got him down a bit, beat him up. But I think I just shot him in the wrong place. I was just trying to shoot his legs, but I think I made him a shot more than that. Um, and yeah, I just saw him lying there, so I had to kind of deal, sort it out, but I don't remember actually what I did. I just remember one time he wasn't there, so I've either got rid of him or it's just found a way out. I, pr I think I probably dumped his body somewhere. Yeah, well, he's not there now, so... I shot him right here, so he's a full body cripple. Either someone saved him, or he's fucking... I, he's just in the middle of the ocean somewhere. Because I'm pretty yeah, sure I probably did that last night when I was all dozed up on those drugs. Well, I haven't seen him in the afterlife, so... I've seen Barry though. So either he's just gone straight to hell on no unfinished business, or, or he's, <laughs> he's alive. just he's, he's alive, alive which is weird to think about. But yeah. as long as he's just struggling in pain or dead, it's fine for me, because yeah. he's just a douchebag. Um, speaking of dead though, remember Barry? Yeah. Been speaking to him. Really? No, after life, yeah. Barry. Barry's a very cool guy. He. Barry. He was only like. 18, 19 when he died of the yeah. body killing, so. Yeah, um, I know, I kind of think of him as a bad person because he tried to kill Potty, but at the same time, he, was a lot, he, ha he had a lot of family pressure. Yeah, it wasn't his um, choice anyway. Like. He, he was the only person working for them, and he would have got killed himself if he didn't do it. Exactly. Um, you know, Skits and, um, what's his name again? Kibo. Kibo would have done something not skits? very good to him. Because I know that... Yeah, yeah. Skids killed me, man. Yeah. yeah. Well, they're dead now too, so... Yeah, yeah. You haven't seen them, they're probably down the fucking depths oh, of yeah, hell. No, I haven't heard of people from those guys. I haven't seen them at all. Yeah, well... But I have they're seen, either I trying have to, seen Kibo's dad, though. They're either trying to keep you a long way from them, or they just... They had no regrets, they're just fucking sinners. Straight down at the yeah, bottom well, of death. Funny part is, I've seen Kibo's dad. Really? Yeah, he's there too. Kibo's dad? He's just hanging out. He did die pretty abruptly because he shot himself, so... I know he's done some bad things, but maybe he just wasn't... He just didn't have as much bad as him as what they thought and what they did. Yeah. Well, I don't know what they all did anyway. Unless he had unfinished business to do. Maybe. Yeah. But, man, I'll see you... Yeah. Later. Yeah, I'll catch you later when you come back from the drive. Yeah, I still got uh, till tonight, so... Yeah. Yeah. I don't know, what are you doing next? Just chilling with ghosts, see, trying to find Bob again? What, what's up to Um, I'm going to some sort of parade and up in the sky, whatever. It's like the black parade, but like, dead or something. It's pretty cool, actually. I have the weirdest fucking life. Yeah.
see the first two films with a lot of old interviews, paying respect to people that di who have died in the process of the film, like Jenny Mirad and uh, the director of this film. So yeah, just in time for tonight, you'll get a notification on your phone for the premiere of Hush Bibble, uh 3. So when that comes out, it's going to be awesome. A lot of scenes that pay tribute to the deaths of the people, and it shows exactly how it happened in the film. So it's a mixture of real-life events, and of course, the good old-fashioned silverware comedy. So stay tuned, and we'll be here all day. Fuck that guy's annoying. Happy. Um, I'm just watching um, Harrison Bimpo, the first one. The first one? Because I heard the third one's dropping on like the Bimpo movie channel because they couldn't afford a theatre release or a cinema release. So. Yeah. Well, why are you watching this though? Well, this I don't sucks. know. Well, I was this watching them to movie. keep up with like the timeline, but I realised that there isn't really a timeline. Yeah, I know. That's why you shouldn't watch the first one. Yeah, two. I didn't know that till just... Yeah. <laughs> What am I like? I'm not very. I'm only eight minutes in, so yeah. Well, yeah. You, um, you I might know, just wait till later. Um, and when like, there's a notification thing on my phone, and it'll tell me when it's premiering. So then I'll be able to just watch that one instead. Yeah. Might get some cold ones. This one's got like twelve percent on Bimpo Critic. Yeah. This, I, the second one has like fifty, but I think that's just people like kind of just. It's more it's like so. Film, apparently, it's more like one. ironic. Yeah. good. This one apparently is kind of like tried to do that, but just became really boring and failed. Um, just didn't succeed. That's what I heard yeah. after. Because I was literally watching this and I was pausing it for a bit, reading reviews. Because I just was just like, really, really? Is it like the first one is the never the worst one in most franchises? But it is here. It yeah. is here. But the second one's more of a cult film. Yeah, though. yeah. It's kind of following. So. But like. I don't know where to premiere, so I was wondering if we could just go glimpse at my phone, like it's just stuck on for some reason. It probably has the thing open. Just yeah. tell me if it says anything on there about the times, um, and I'll just go grab some beers and meet you at the top. But before you go, I just I know you've been trying real hard, trying really hard, sorry, to find Bob around here in, in East Bimpo, So I just want to say like thanks for all that. Yeah, but, it's all good, man. Yeah, I'll just see you soon. Yo, um, Cliff, this is kind of like random, but I was just wondering, like, I know you were talking about, back a while ago actually, that you had some unfinished business to do, and I was just wondering what that was, like, I know you said you couldn't tell me, but is now the time? Cliff?
Big titties. <laughs>